loses final. I think that's all. That's all his setup right now. I think that's all the brackets are. So they are doing a button check right now. So it's looking like the the Mega Man versus Kmaus Zero Suit Samus. Uh, well, if he does go for Zero Suit Samus, he might just be button checking with her. But uh, he's probably gonna go Zero Suit Game One uh, until he loses and. Once he does lose, it's probably gonna go to Bayonetta. Uh, so everything, yep, might might just check in everything, put it in his glide toss, missing it that time, and that time, <laughs> yep, just just practicing. All right. So go. So. Mm. So we're gonna go into it, and this win is final. So best, best three out of five. So we're gonna see a lot of action here. Everyone's probably sitting down at home. Everyone's sitting down here at AnimeCon, just patiently waiting for these two to get at it, and let's we'll see where they go. Where they're gonna go from game one. A lot of the game ones have been on Smashville. A lot of the game ones have been on Smashville today. So they're hovering over it. They're thinking about it. Um, oh, hold on. They're they're asking a question now. What's the problem, guys? All right, just give me one moment uh, while I just figure out what's happening. You guys good? You good. Okay, and we are going into it. No. I would speak about this matchup, but Mikey has been the kind of guy that he said he doesn't care what is bad for Mega Man in a matchup. He does not care. He will find a way. That's that's his thing. And he said that to me uh, in September 2014 when we were playing on 3DS. He said, I am going to main this character and I'm going to beat every character on this roster with this character. So. Time will tell, time will tell. But KMR's objective here is to just work out his way around the projectiles that Mikey will be putting out to you know just keep his spacing tight. And he's gonna wanna get those guys, he's gonna wanna juggle Mega Man. Mega Man is relatively easy to juggle, decent sized hurt box. He is not floaty, he is not a fast faller. He's right he's in that in between where He's not combo food, but combos wouldn't really drop on him. But uh, right now, came out fighting, losing battle. Ooh, Mikey went for a, a pivot grab there. He probably wanted a back throw. It might have killed at 107. Also, not sure about that. Uh, it would have resulted in an edge guard. And there is the Trump to back here. Uh, Mike with the stock lead. Kima will want to get back into this. And nice option getting the RV. Ooh. Alright, Mikey is going to want to settle himself, take a little time. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, a Saitama cosplayer just walked in. Here. They he fully equipped with a ball head and everything. You know, I took a moment to marvel at that. Now uh, back to the game. Came out, has him at 108 percent. He's gonna want to try to get a kill here without taking too much damage. I mean, Mega Man still has to do a fair amount of things to net kills. His most reliable kill option is the back here. Is the pack here, but uh, he oh wow, that crash bomb nearly caused the gimp there. <laughs> well, uh, now KMO's in a very, very bad place. Yep, yeah, that should kill. That should kill. The rage definitely is gonna cause it to kill. It would not have killed earlier because of the lack of rage, but definitely, definitely this time. Definitely this time. Good job, KMO. 
Okay, so this is this is the part that I didn't I didn't really remember. Uh, came out also as a link, but um, I thought he would have gone for Bayonetta. He's probably gonna go for Bayonetta if he does lose with the link. Um, if Mikey Mates is 2-0 right now, he's probably gonna go Bayonetta game three. But that depends on how this game goes. They've gone for Omega Battlefield, which probably was an error. Which probably was an error. They, you know, they probably just slipped their mind for a little bit. Just remember, uh, it's a tournament. Uh, not the Omega stages are a problem, you know. You're just trying to keep to the... Oh, wow. Mike allowed him to make the character switch. Opting not to use the link. And Mike says, okay, whichever character you please. So here we go. This this will be a little more interesting. Bayonetta, uh, not a outright better character than Zero Suit Samus. Very comparable. But uh, Kiyama is more adept with his Bayonetta than his Zero Suit Samus. Ah, and he's a good little sequence there to get into percent on Mikey. But Mikey is going to want to fight back. Good read on the up here to hold him in place. And then clap him on. Here we go. And. Oh, okay. That was a little scary for KML. Those two up here is there. <laughs> Mikey quickly establishing a lead in the game after taking an early. A early uh, we <laughs> went behind there a little early. <laughs> but uh, he's, in, he's in control now. That's all he cares about. He doesn't care if he starts to lose early on. He's always composed. Both of these players, really, they always compose. You know, it's, don't get too panicky. And KML okay, still trying to stick it to Mike. With the jabs. Ooh, he went for the witch time. Uh, Mikey went for a roll, he didn't go for an attacking option. Oh, nice read. Oh, he got the trump. And that'll be a spike. Hard knuckle. Send him Bayonetta to the depths. Now, Bayonetta's supposed to be next immortal, you know, the hard... What, what, what does immortality say to a hard knuckle? Yeah. And came out is trying to come up with that answer. Oh, <laughs> back kick. That identical back here almost to Zero Suit Samus. Trying to get a kill in here. Yep. Mike with the reverse here, rush back here. That's uh I don't wanna say Mega Man's bread and butter, but Mike certainly knows all the scenarios where a reverse air rush back air is just the way to go and you're gonna see a lot of it just fair warning you're gonna see a lot of it and ooh, went for the read went for the up tilt got a solid spot it's good enough as long as you get the hit you know it's no punish uh, punishing that but don't smash bit of macho and he's spiking him with the gear not sure what KML could have done in that situation now that he's in, since he was down there, that was wow. That was something. Best he could have done was probably stick close to the wall. So yeah, he's gonna stick to Bayonetta for game three. He's definitely not going with the link. Uh, better. Excuse me. Uh, there it is again with the uh, the reverse air rush back here. Mikey with the slow, very slow and ominous walk up to then hit him with the up smash. KML is not establishing himself well in this game, and this is the this is the one that it has to matter. It has to count. Oh wow! And Mikey with the exact same setup as last game. 
trumping but not going for the back here probably wouldn't have killed that's why he didn't go for it you know, he allowed him to get back to the ledge to get him with the hard knuckle misplaced it and ooh, that hard knuckle connected but Benes uh, he just I, I don't know he just ate it saving KML's life yeah. let's see what KML does with his extra life and he stays in his shield for a little too long pivot grab just completely decimates him he's a stock behind he's very far behind on percent on this stock he's gonna have to come with a very hard read or you know he's gonna have to change something about his gameplay right now to be able to get back into this game because Mikey is he's all over KML right now in this game it's all over him KML is letting Mikey have his way almost and if this continues then you know KML is going to find himself in the loser's bracket but KML fighting back solid jab can't seem to get in once you know Mikey Man is constantly putting out those lemons up smash punish two up airs following up Bayonetta is at a magic percent but how much longer can that last can he get the kill with the magic percent it's looking good you know, <laughs> everyone is convinced that he's, oh well, he's off it now. He's off it now. I might, I might make a difference. And see what happens. You know, everyone, everyone, pretty much believes that uh, once someone is at 69%, you know, weird things happen in Smash or someone. Oh, and that is a very risky move. Like he goes for the soft punish. He goes for the grab. Uh, Four throw, setting up the edge guard situation. And Mikey going for the sure you can, but it whiffed, and that allows Kiyomal to hit him with a uppercut of his own. Well, not only the uppercut, but you know the demon hand just coming from below, punching Mega Man directly into the same jaw that uh, Mikey had intentions. He had intentions to hit Kiyomal in his jaw, so. Came out, just clapped them back with a piece of his own, but that up smash barely does it, but it does it nevertheless. And that would be game three. Uh, Mikey moves on to grand final, and that's 3 0 to Mike. So, next, next, it's not losers, it's not losers now. It's not losers now. They have to fight to see who faces you, Kima. Mm. 